In this exercise, we're going to learn how to create a site for our building complex. To do this, we first need to come underneath Site in our project browser. Under Floor Plans, we're going to open up the Site view. From here, we can zoom out so we can see the outer extents of where we may draw our site to. Now we need to use the Site Tools, or in particular the Topo Surface Tool, to draw in where our site is going to be located at. To do this, come underneath the Massing and Site tab and pick on Topo Surface. Where it says Elevation, let's give this an elevation of 3 feet. And the first spot that we're going to pick is going to be in the upper left hand side of the screen. Pick another spot straight across from that previous spot that you picked, but in the upper right hand side of your screen. For the next elevation, make this be a much smaller number. In this case, we're going to do negative 4 feet. Click somewhere right in this general location. What it's done is it's automatically created our different contour lines from this elevation down to this elevation. Click again down over in this area, and we can see it continuing the creator site and the contour lines that are associated with that. As for the elevation I like to have around the building, let's make this be negative 8 eight inches. Pick each of the corners that are going around our building. By doing this, those spots are at negative eight inches. You can start to see that this is sort of going around our buildings now instead of going directly through the buildings, and it's all starting to flow down and in this direction. So if any water starts to fall due to rain or whatever the case may be, it's going to start to flow toward and then ultimately around our building down toward this portion of the site. Now that we've done that, click on the big green check mark to finish that off. Come up here to the top and click on the little house icon, the 3D view command. Here's the site with its contours. If we move down here to the visual styles, we can even turn on shaded to start to see some color. You can spin your model around by holding down the shift key as well as the wheel on the mouse to see how it's sloping down. Our building is currently sitting right there on the site. So we were able to create this topo surface, also known as a site, by coming up here on the massing and site tab and then picking on topo surface and picking each of these points and setting the appropriate elevations for each of those point locations.